Church. Uh, I am the Delaware District Administrator of Reliable Aid Inc. I'm also the founder of the company. You may not want to pay for some paid help. Uh, you might say, hey man, you know, that paid help, it, it costs too much. I'm going to tell you all a true story. The other day, a young lady told me, she said, Casey, if I wanted what you were selling, I would already have that. <laughs> I said, hey baby girl, you know, that's cool, but how do your parents feel about that? You know, how do your parents feel about you going out every night? You know what I mean? I mean, you're grown, they're grown, but I mean, you you thinking like they should just sit home by themselves, you know, while you're at work trying to work hard and make all the money. I mean, it's good that you're going out and, and you know, but you can't leave your parents on home alone. That's neglect. Take care of your parents like they took care of you, man. Your parents are your biggest asset. You know, they're our biggest investment. They loved you. They made sure you got to where you are today. How do I know that? Because you're a big hearted caregiver just like me. You're here with me now. Your parents are more important. You need to make them into the priority. Parents are your best resources. They're, uh, you know, the parents are our energy for the future. You know, we are the ones who are going to lead them to the uh, to the promised land. Now that they're older, take care of your parents. Now, when we talk about the older folk, they desperately, I'm not even going to say definitely, they desperately need security, structure, and stability. So you as the adult, child of the senior, you're going to be the rock. You are their rock. They kind of lose in steps. Uh, life's not a dress rehearsal. Your aging parents are aging more faster day to day and their health may be on a decline. I just want to let you know, people can only judge you based on who they are, not who you are. See, listen, if you here right now, you a big hearted caregiver and I already know that. So these people that's trying to judge you, they're not big hearted caregivers. So I don't even know why you letting them get into your mind space. What I want to tell you is, you know, the first thing uh, is basically realizing uh, what's going on in their life. You're going to find yourself in some compromising situations. You may need a little help. You, you got to see through it because you got to remember that uh, adults and children kind of suffer from the same thing. And just how somebody raised you up, you, you're going to need to reach back and grab onto the people that you love so you can bring them out of the muck just like you. They're your parents, it's your mommy, it's your daddy, you go by there every day, you know they need a little more, you're not around anymore, you know, or as much as you used to be, or even as much as you would like to be. You know, you got a full-time job you need to maintain, you have children, uh, you got wife, kids, a husband, family members, you know, you got a lot of stuff going on. Now, how do I know that they took care of you? Because you're just like me, you're a big hearted caregiver and how'd you get that way? You got that way because some people took care of you in the very beginning. They looked out for you when you didn't have nobody to be, you know, even be looking out for you. So now it's your time. You got to spread the love. Helping people is a good thing. Uh, most of us are familiar with the problems of domestic abuse. Partners hurting each other, children being emotionally and physically battered. But there's another group of people who suffer at the hands of people that they trust. These are the oldest people in our society. And to tell you the truth, there are parents. I'm sure they didn't, did not neglect you. What you need to do is give back to your parents who took care of you, because you know, that's what it's about. Your parents need help. It's obvious, you know? They want good help. It's obvious. Everybody wants to be treated like a human being. It's obvious. What are you going to do? You going to step it up? Are you going to become the caregiver that your parents need? You may be the one uh, to have to help your parents out. You may be the one to have to come to your parents' rescue. It might be you who's going to be your biggest, uh, your parents' biggest ally and go-to. Because like I said, life's not a dress rehearsal and you need what to do fast with your parents. You know, every day is going by, the clock is ticking, nobody's getting younger, including you. So now's the time. Put forth your best effort, take care of your parents because they are your best asset. You know, I'm sure your parents and loved ones, they got things that they need to do every day. They have uh, responsibilities. And, and, and for nothing else, you don't want to see them fall behind. You want to see them just like you in good spirits, good health. You want to see them looking good, you know, getting up, doing what they got to do every day. What I want to do is keep my parents' uh, dignity and their respect and, you know, their self-confidence together. So we had to put a team together. Make sure your peoples are well taken care of. If you don't know what to do, call Reliable Aiding, 302-689-3240. 302-689-3240. All right, and I'm Mr. KC, your Delaware District Administrator. If you need any help, ReliableAid.info. Go to the website, call me, live your best.